Hi and welcome back. Today I'm wrapping my hands around this Asus ROG Strix. It's thermal throttling, loud as hell and it's time to fix the biggest mistake a laptop manufacturer could make. And that's cheaping out on some thermal paste. First we start with removing these 10 Phillips heads. One of them is hidden under a rubber cover. Ok, now we can pop out the plastic cover, where we can access the mechanical hard drive and NVMe stick. Remove these 7 Phillips heads and then pull out the hard drive. Next, take a flat head and gently pry the back cover loose in these two corners. At this point, the back cover should come off. Before we go further, unplug the battery so we don't short any components. Now, remove these 13 Phillip heads that hold on the beefy looking cooler. Lift the cooler up, be gentle, because the fans are still connected. Now find something soft, push out the fan connectors and remove the cooler assembly. Clean the old paste but watch out for the surface mounted chips on the GPU. I am using Thermal Grizzly Cryonauts, affiliate link in the description. This will help the channel to keep improving the quality of the videos. But hey, feel free to buy whatever you want. At this point, you can repeat all the steps in reverse. Oh yeah, are you wondering why I made those holes in the back? The back plate is super restrictive. So with this simple barge, the fans breathe a lot better now. For benchmarking, I will use three games. First, Battlefield 5 which taxes the GPU and CPU at almost 100% for the whole benchmark. Second, Tropico 6, which is heavy on the GPU. And then we have Doom, which is one of the best optimized games out till this day. And I must say, the results are huge. In the next video, I am building a laptop cooling pad from scratch, using three 120mm fans, on USB power, so consider subscribing if you aren't yet, and enjoy the rest of the video. This was Noisy Works, and I see you in the next one.